How do you do, ladies and gentlemen, and boys and girls, and people abundant? I am the Professor Julius Sumner Miller, and physics is my business. And we are talking about the beautiful music that emerges from vibrating bars. Two steel bars mounted on resonating chambers. The bars have a certain mechanical frequency. The box is so long. Very nicely measured and calculated. And so what we wish to see is as follows. I strike this one. Stop it. And that one has taken up the energy. Now, they are resonant. They are identical in frequency, mechanically, and acoustically. Now, I am going to load the prongs, the prong, perhaps both, of one of these forks with a heavy rubber band. Now, I am increasing the inertia. Oh, it'll take a little bit because I am clumsy and old and not accustomed to these things after 50 years. I have loaded this, and let's see now what happens. There is some beat frequency apparent, but I'm going to make it heavier because the first inertia of the unloaded bar is very great, and it needs a heavier load than I have. Now listen, now listen. Let me load it even more. I am making, <clears throat> excuse me, I am making this one of lower and lower frequency and therefore of lower and lower pitch and they are becoming more different and hence a greater beat frequency. And they are no longer resonant. So what you are getting is an array of pulses from one and an array of pulses from the other, not always in phase. And this gives rise to the silence, which we refer to as a beat.